What's going on everybody? My name is Jeans, back with some more Double Battles for Pokemon Sword. Before this video even starts, you guys know the deal. Show some support by smashing that like button, clicking that subscribe button, and let me know in the comment section down below. Seriously, the support means a lot. We passed 500 subs, and I cannot thank you guys enough. As you guys can tell already, my voice is on fire. My throat is killing me right now. But we're still pumping out that content for you guys, so you guys are just going to have to deal with my raspy voice for today's video. But guys, in today's video, we're actually rocking out with this Hailstorm team right here. I know a lot of people requested Frostlass, so here you guys go. Here's a Hailstorm team with Frostlass in it, and rocking in the front spot is Vanellix right here, which I am actually hyped to use Vanellix. A little ice cream cone, double ice cream cone right here. Rocking Snow Warning to actually set the hail. Snow Warning is its ability. It actually rocks out kind of like Drizzle, like Pelipper. So once it gets into battle, hail is going to start till the end of the game, actually. Until actually the end of the battle or if somebody switches it up. So it's good. It's not just five turns like anything else. It will keep going until it's switched up or the battle's over. Rocking out with Light Clay also as its item with Blizzard, Freeze Dry, Aurora Veil, and Protect. Aurora Veil is actually kind of like a Reflect and Light Screen mixed into one. So it will reduce damage from special attacks and physical attacks. With that light clay, it will actually be boosted to 8 turns, so it rocks out. It rocks out. Then we got a physical attack over here with Conkador rocking that life orb with Mach Punch for first turn priority. Fire Punch, Rock Slide, and Brick Break to break the screens and all that good stuff. Then, the most favorite Pokemon on this team right here, we got Frost Slash with Ice Beam and Shadow Ball for Stab, Thunderbolt, and Psychic for coverage. Rocking that Choice Scarf actually boosts his speed up so he can actually outspeed some Pokemon in some close battles. Then we got another physical attacker rocking... Darmanitan right here. Ice Pokemon here to work in the hail a little bit better with Ice Punch, Fire Punch, Brick Break, and you turn Brick Break to break the screens. Once again, he's actually Choice Banner, so we're going to actually choice him to one move in order for him to do more damage. Then we got Leftovers Milotic, which we actually used in the last video. It's an absolute beast. Absolute beast with competitive as his ability and Scald, Icy Wind, Protect, and Recover as its moveset. Then we got Grimstar rocking in the back end with his Expert Belt. Expert Belt allows us to do more damage with super effective moves. Rock and Reflect, Circle Punch for our first turn priority, Spirit Break, and T Wave. Rock and Prankster as its ability also. So T Wave and Status Moves will get first move priority. But guys, if you'd like to use this team for yourself, rental code is at the bottom of the screen. Definitely check it out. This team looks like a ton of fun with Vanellix and Frost Slice. I cannot wait to use it. But guys, let me know for a question today. Again, not a question. I just want you guys to rental codes. Leave them in the comment section down below. I would love to use your guys' teams for videos. But without further ado, let's get on with this video. Here we go, guys. This guy's rocking out with a Snorlax, Espeon, Darmanitan, Oranguru, Greedent, and a Togekiss. I can see him possibly going into that Greedent. No lie, trying to get a Belly Drum, going with the Greedent and the Oranguru. I definitely want to get that Hail Start, so I'm going to go Vanellix in the front spot. Then do we roll out with Milotic? We could potentially roll out with Milotic. Milotic could be huge here in the beginning, but I want to bring Frost Slice in the back and possibly Conkledor here. He actually doesn't have a lot to take out my Ice Pokemon. I might just go All Out Ice on him. Do we go All Out Ice? I'm thinking that. I think we go Vanellix here. We might want to start with our Choice Band here. We want to start off with our Choice Band because I can see him going in the Greedent here. And maybe belly drumming. And we might just want to go after that thing. So yeah, let's go with Darmanitan in the front spot and bring out Milotic and our Choice Scarf Frost Slash in the back end. Because he doesn't have too much to take us out over Ice Pokemon. So we're going to go all ice in the beginning. Try to get this Hail team running out here. But guys, if you'd like to catch more content from me, make sure you head in the link in the description below. Jeans25 on Twitch. I stream four plus days every single week. It's tons of fun. We're trying to push Master Ball tier in Season 2. But who's this guy going to start off with? Like I said, probably the Rangaroo and the... Uh, What's it called? Rangaroo and the Greedon. Perfect. The Snow Warning comes off here from our Vanellux. We get the hail off any lead, the Rangaroo, and that Greedon. We're going to try to take out that Greedon because I can see it definitely going for a, what's it called? A Belly Jump, eating a Berry, have Cheek Pouch as his ability, and Rangaroo is going to uh, make an attack twice, I think. So we're going to go for an Aurora Rail here. Actually lower the damage, and we're going to go straight after that. Uh, we you turn out. I want to go after that, what's it called? I love the Brick Break. I love the Brick Break, but I might just Dynamax go into a Max Knuckle here, right off the bat. I think Brick or Max Knuckle might be super effective over on that Greedent. Yeah, we're going to go for that right off the bat. We're coming for you. We're coming for you, Greedent. We're coming for you hard here. I don't want it to Belly Drum set up and just swamp all my team. Hopefully, we can get this Aurora Veil off with this Light Screen too, which would be huge. It would be huge. Like I said, it's like a Reflect and a Light Screen all in one. Dude, look at this dude. Big head over here. Big head Darmanitan coming in here. We got to go after this Greedent here. We gotta go after him. Let's get it. Let's get it, Darmanitan. Take him out. I don't think he's gonna take it out. This thing's an absolute beast, but we're gonna boost our attack here, which is huge. Which is huge. Let's get it. Boop. Nice little damage there. Will Belly Drum actually kill itself now? Will Belly Drum actually kill itself? Because I think it could be going for a Belly Drum. Let's see what it does. Let's see what it does. 
go. Oh, we're gonna outspeed here and get the War of Veil off, which is beautiful. Let's set up here. Let's set up, dude. We look good with this hail going here. Hail's gonna buff them all. Belly jump's gonna pop out here, and it's gonna fail. Beautiful, beautiful. And the Ragnarok's gonna get this Trick Room rolling, which I'm fine with. This thing cannot belly jump anymore and try to set up. So we're chilling, we're chilling. The hail's gonna buff them, take off any focus ashes that are on them, and now we're chilling. Now we are chilling, we are looking good. Do we boost our attack once again? Freeze drive, what's freeze drive do? Okay, it can leave the target frozen. It's super effective on water times. Wow, that's cool, that's cool. We might just go for a blizzard here. We might just go for an all around blizzard on the team with our vanillix, with our ice cream cone. And we're gonna keep the storm rolling. I think we're just gonna, uh, what are we gonna do? Kill that with a special attack. I think we're just gonna boost our Manitan's, uh, physical attack. Or we might go into a hailstorm and get the, uh, the what's it called? The stab. I kinda want that greedy out the way. I really do want that greedy out the way. Hmm. Let's go. Let's get this greedy out the way. We're gonna go for a hailstorm here. Maybe I should have went for another max knuckle, but we're chilling. Gyro Ball's gonna pop out here on my Darmantan. But my Dar Darmantan's just gonna eat that up. No problem. No problem. Ragnarok's gonna chill here. He's gonna do his little instruct. Greedy's gonna get up another Gyro Ball, which is fine. We will eat that up once again, which is fine. Okay, we're chilling. We're chilling. That's what I thought he was gonna go into. I thought he was gonna go belly drum. This was, this was my read. Oh, Blizzard comes off strong. Yes, let's get it. Nice damage here. He's going to eat a berry, but I still think we take him out with his max hailstorm here. With his plus one attack. Is he cheek pouch? Is he cheek pouch? He is cheek pouch. That hunk of junk. We might not be able to take him out now. Oh my god, dude. That health. That health is ridiculous. Can we take him out with his max hailstorm? Let's see it. Let's see it. Show it to me, Darmanitan. Do some work here with your plus one attack. Do it for me. Let's go. Let's go, Darmanitan. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Ice move with that stab and in that hail does some work but like i said i thought he was gonna go out, out into the rangaroo and if we didn't like i said but we're going into zen mode and then i remember i was thinking he was gonna go into that belly jump so he went after him early on then i thought he was gonna go into an attack move with instruct to double kill our pokemon because a lot of people do that a lot of people do that with the greedy and they're not a rangaroo but we are in zen mode now and we still have that war veil popping out on us which is awesome which is awesome this could be a gigantamax Snorlax. it could be not gonna lie here um, what are we going to go here? I think we just rock out with another blizzard here. We're just going to rock out with another blizzard. I think we're just going to boost our... We just go after Snorlax here. I think they're going to take out my, uh... My Darmanitan here. I think that's exactly what's going to happen here. But I kind of want to get another stab move off. We go for that Oranguru. Let's go for that Oranguru, actually. We're going to try to take out that Oranguru here. To try not to get it to what's it called. Oh, Fire Punch. Okay, we eat that up. Because we are Zen mode. Stupid. But instruction to come out here. We should be able to eat that up again. But we're going to try to take out this Oranguru so it doesn't roll into another Trick Room. Because if we can get another Trick Room off, that would be tough for us. Fire Punch, we should be able to eat, right? We do eat it up. Dude, Darmantan survives all three turns in his Dynamax and gets some work done. Blizzard comes out. Let's go. Any freezes? Any freezes? No freezes. But the Max Hailstorm will finish off this Oranguru, which is beautiful. And the Buffet will go up against that Snorlax. Let's go, dude. This Hail team is rocking out here. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Let's go. Buff it by the hail. A little bit of damage. But like I said, dude, snow warning, hail will last all game. It will last all game until somebody switches it up, which I'm fine with. I'm fine with. But we got to get rid of that. What's it called? That Snorlax with that fire punch. That, sh that could be deadly. That could be deadly. This is what's it called. No, no, no. We still have like two more turns in the trick room. I was going to ask if the trick room's almost done. Look at this. Okay, so two more turns in trick room. Five with the roar bear. Two with the hail? I thought it lasts all game. Never mind. Never mind. I might be wrong. I might be wrong. Okay, let's go into fight here. Uh, do we rock out into another blizzard here? Or do we go into a freeze dry here? We're gonna try to freeze this uh, Espeon here. And do we U-turn out here? This, this thing is pretty fast. We could U-turn out here. But I think we just go for an Ice Punch here over on this Espeon. Try to do some work on it. I can see him Gigantamax in his Snorlax here. Let's see. Yep, Snorlax is gonna get that Gigantamax. It's probably Gigantamax form. If not, I don't really matter if it's just Dynamax form. But he's gonna go into those tree looking things. It looks like Torterra. No, he's regular Dynamax. No Gigantamax or like. Poo poo for him. Poo poo. <laughs> Dude's poo poo, man. Dude's poo poo. I hate how my voice is all just messed up, man. Just messed up. I can't say my normal sayings. He's gonna go into a max player. Take out the drought. Can we eat this up? Vanellox will eat this up. That's cool. That's cool. Vanellox will eat that up. And here comes the drought. No more, no more hail. No more hail, which is tough. Let's see. What are we gonna rock into here? Psychic Fang's gonna pop out. Can we eat that up? We eat that up. Mm, we do not eat that up. And a war veil war off. You hunk of junk. You hunk of junk. We might just go into a protect here after this freeze dry. But if we can get a freeze on this Espeon, that'd be beautiful. That'd be beautiful. Show it to me. Show it to me. We get a crit and a freeze. Nope, no freeze. 
Let's see rocking leftovers. Rocking leftovers on them. Yep. Leftovers on that Espeon. Now who are we gonna go into? We're gonna go into this uh Milotic and save our choice card for the end. We can outspeed and all that. But Vanellix is chilling. I think we're gonna go into a protect on that Vanellix here. I wanna get off another Aurora Veil. I would love to. 86 damage. That will take us out. That will take us out, especially in this heat. And we're gonna see if we can eat up another shot. And we're gonna go into a icy wind here and lower the speed of both the Pokemon. So whenever the trick room ends, we'll be chilling. We'll be chilling. Let's see. Protect comes out from Ben and Jerry. I love the names on these Pokemon. Whoever made this rental team, good job on the names. Ben and Jerry for the ice cream. Back darkness is gonna pop out on who? On who? My Milotic. Okay, that's fine. We'll eat that up with that Milotic. We can go into a recover next turn, which is fine. But we're gonna go into an icy wind. Try to do some work. Hopefully that uh that S bound goes against my what's it called? Goes for my Vanellix because we are protected, but our attack does raise here. Icy Wind's gonna pop out here. You do a little bit of damage. Lower the speed. Lower the speed of that Snorlax. Let's go. Does it get that Espeon too? It does get that Espeon. Look at us. We're sitting pretty here. Second Fang's gonna pop out here. Protect. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Dang, dude. We should have went for the what's it called? We should have went for that Aurora Veil. No, he's just gonna take it off. He's just gonna take it off eventually. But we're gonna go into a recover with our uh with our Milo tick. Okay, no, we outspeed now. We outspeed now. So we're going to go for that Aurora Veil once again. Try to get that set up with that Light Clay. And then we are just going to go into a recover with our Milotic. Kind of just to stay still. Kind of just to relax here. And get his Dynamax turns out the way. But we do outspeed. Espeon's going to protect, which is fine by me. We're going to get this Aurora Veil off before the Snorlax goes now. Which is perfect. It failed. How did it fail? What do you mean it failed? Didn't she take it down? Or do we still have it rocking out here? I'm confused. I am confused. Let's see. Max Fire's gonna come out here on my Vanellux. Take him out. That's fine. But I'm confused on how that failed. I'm confused on how that failed. Alright, we might just have to go after this Snorlax here and just punk on it. I'm confused on how that Aurora Veil failed. I thought the Psychic Fangs broke it off. I'll check in a second. I'll check in a second. But we get our Choice Scarf out here, which is beautiful. We are stab. We are super effective against that Espeon. Not too worried about the Espeon. We can take it out, but I want that Snorlax out the way. I need that Snorlax out the way, so I think we're going to double up on that Snorlax here. I think we're just going to double up on that Snorlax here. Try to take him out. But let me check something. Let me check that info. Do we still have a Roar Veil? No. Does the Harsh Sunlight keep it away? Might be able to uh, stop the... What's it called? Might be able to stop the Roar Veil. But what did... Hold up. What did that player say? It said, Harsh Sunlight, it... Uh, no, no, no. I was looking at this. Okay, never mind. Okay. We're chilling. We're chilling. Okay, let's hop into this. What are we going to go for? Shadow Ball? We gotta go against the Snorlax. We gotta go up against the Snorlax. So we're gonna go try to just double it up on the Snorlax here. We go for an Icy Wind. I, I said we just go for a Scald. Potentially get that burn on him. Let's go. Double it up on the Snorlax. We will outspeed. Both of our Pokemon should outspeed him here. Especially my Frost Lass with that Choice Scarf. Let's see. Do some work on him with that Sad Move. Mm, can we get the Freeze? Can we get the Freeze? No Freeze, but Scald's gonna pop out here. I'm just scared of that, uh, what's it called? Oh, we get the burn. We get the burn. Which is beautiful. I'm just scared of the, what's it called? That fire punch coming across on my frost ice. He just needs to eat one. He just needs to eat one here. Eat it up, buddy. He eats it up. Beautiful. We will be able to take out that Snorlax here. No problem with that ice beam. We're going to ice beam it. And then what are we going to go? Or we can go into a shadow ball and make sure that Snorlax dies. We can go into a shadow ball on that Espeon. And that Snorlax should die from uh, the burn and the skull. Do I really want to play it? How do I want to play this? Do I really want to play it that way? We're just going to make sure that Snorlax dies. We're going to make sure that Snorlax dies. I can see him going into a protect here. You think he's going to go into a protect? That's fine. We're just going to go Scald up on that Espeon. That's fine by me. Let's see. Ice Beam's going to pop out. See you later, Snorlax. And then we should just be chilling here. That should be the game. Oh, no. Oh, no. He might take out my Snorlax or my Frost Lass. But we're chilling. We're chilling. Psychic Fang's going to pop out here. He's going to take out my Frost Lass, isn't he? No, don't you dare go for a Fire Punch on him. No! No! Frost Lass is done. Frost Lass is done. Okay, we're chilling. We're chilling. We should have doubled up. I thought that would have killed him. But this harsh sunlight has faded. That's fine. The burn should take out the Snorlax here. Finish him off. And then it's just a 1v1 situation. We can just constantly go for Scalds here and finish off this Espeon. That's going to be the game, guys. It's going to be the game. This Hail team rocked out, dude. Rocked out. I'm absolutely loving it. Absolutely loving it. I love that Vanellix especially. Vanellix and Frost Lass are awesome, dude. Something about ice cream cones. The ice cream cones just rock out. This guy gonna leave because he knows we can outsaw him all day. Let's go for another Scald on him. Potentially try to get a burn. But this might be able to take him out. This might be able to take him out. We do outspeed. My Milotic outspeeds him. Let's get it. 
We're gonna get this skull on him. Yeah, you baby. Take him out. Let's go. Let's go, baby. GG. GG. That is how it's done, dude. This hail team is sick, dude. I'm loving it so far. Who's next? Who wants the sauce from this ice hail team right here with my boy Ice Cream Cone Vanilla? I think it's this guy. Daniel wants it. Rocking Configurus, Ndidi, Hatterene Torkoal, Conkledor, and a Mudstyle. This guy's definitely rocking a Trick Room team. He's rolling out with the Trick Room team. Probably going Ndidi, follow me. Probably going Ndidi, follow me. We're definitely leading that Vanilla. We just have to get that Torkoal out the way. There's no way he's going Torkoal right off the bat. There's no way he's going Torkoal right off the bat. So we're going to go... Vanellox, Darmanitan, Milo Tick. I think we're going same crew. We're going same crew. We go same crew. Or do we throw him a curveball? And instead of Darmanitan, we go in with our life orb right off the bat. Let's go in with our life orb. Let's go. Ben and Jerry into Pennywise. Have Milo Tick. And oh, dude, I want to go in with my uh. Mm. Now we're gonna keep this. We're gonna keep this. We're gonna roll out strong here. Right off the bat. Let's get it, guys. Let's get it. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready to give this guy to Merc. I know he's not probably going in DD had a bean right off the bat. But we got we just gotta watch out for that Torkoal. We gotta watch out for that Torkoal. I'm thinking maybe he's gonna go after one of my ice Pokemon with Torkoal. I can hard swap into my what's it called? My Milotic, get a free shot off. Maybe go into some protects and all that. Do some work. We just have to be careful with this Torkoal. We have to be very, very careful with this Torkoal here. So gotta watch out. Just gotta watch out. Let's get it. Let's get it. Who's he leading? Who's he leading? DD had a Ndidi Hattering, Configurus Ndidi. Okay, so he's going to set up Trick Room with the, that Configurus. I might dine my, uh, ch -ch -ch -ch, my boy right here. My Conquador. But we got this Hailstorm. No one, no one strong right here. And we're going to roll into an Aurora Veil. Psychic Surge going to pop out here. Is this thing rocking Psychic Seeds at Configurus? That thing looks whack. That thing really does look whack. The Configurus. Okay. Aurora Veil popping off here. Boom. Beautiful, beautiful. Um, do we get for a Rock Side Mach Punch? Uh... We're gonna go for a rock side, potentially get some flinches off here. We're gonna potentially get some flinches off off on that configure so it doesn't get off that trick room. Because we know it's gonna go follow me trick room. We know exactly what's happening. We know exactly what is happening. Like what is he taking so long for? We know what you're doing. You already know what you're doing. You were planning to do this before the match even started. You're just like, oh, I'm going in DD configures to go follow me trick room. Blah, 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 blah. The normal thing. Like, I do it all the time. Everybody who plays these teams does it all the time. It's only what Ndidi is good for. Especially, except for that one time where I use Ndidi with the choice specs on it. Whoo! Ripped up. It ripped up. For sure. Nobody was expecting it. It's like, oh, this thing's going to follow me. I was like, nah, son. Flamethrower. Choice specs. Dead. <laughs> Come on. What's this guy doing? Why is he taking so long? I swear, if he just goes into a follow me and that... We do outspeed. He's not going for a follow me. He choice scarf. He's scarfed up. Or specked up. Second's gonna pop out here. We should be able to eat. Yeah, we do eat. Cool, cool, cool. With that, what's it called? With that, um. What is it called? The roar barrel up. Did some work. There we go. Do some damage. Can we flinch this? We didn't flinch it. No! No. But that indeedy was faster than my uh, Conkledor. That indeedy was faster than my Conkledor. We're going to double up on that NDD here. And my uh, Configurus is going to go first. Then it's going to go. It's going to go Configurus, Conkledor. So if that thing doesn't take out my. Uh, what's it called? If he doesn't take out my uh, Conkledor here, we're going to get off another rock slide. Do some work. Let's go for it. Let's get it. Let's go. Let's go. What's he going to do? What are you going to do, fool? He's dead. He should go after my. Uh, what's it called? Right after that. Because NDD, Conkledor goes before NDD. Let's see. Body press on who? Oh my, Vanellix, we, we take those, we take those. That's what, exactly what I want. Conqueror should go now. Pennywise, yep, goes for Rock Side. We'll take out that Ndidi, which is beautiful. Which is perfect, which is perfect. And then this Blizzard's gonna slide over to that Cup Figures. Come on, hit it, land it, buddy, land it, buddy. My boy, Vanellix, beautiful. We love to see it. Do some work, take him out. Oh, what? What do you mean? Okay, Hail comes out, Hail comes out. Gonna take out that Cup Figures and probably take out my uh, Conqueror here too. Oh, can he eat, can he eat? He does eat, which is beautiful, which is beautiful. We still have Mach Punch to get first turn priority. That's probably what we're going to roll out with with him. So we don't just waste uh, the last turn. Hatterene's going to pop out here. We're going to punch on that thing. We're going to punch on it. We're depending on what this is. Oh, we're going to punch on that Torkoal. That is exactly what we're going to do. We're going to punch on that Torkoal. I'm going to go for a, what's it called? Oh, you want good junk. You want good junk. Taking away my, what's it called? Taking away. 
I hail, we're gonna go into a protect, and we're gonna just go into a mock punch here. We're gonna slide it over to this Torkoal. I'll do a little bit of damage on a Torkoal before we go out. Before we do go out, try going for like a Dazzling Gleam or something. We might Dynamax this Torkoal in this drought. It's gonna be tough. We gotta get this uh, out the way. Oh, I maybe should have hard swapped out. I maybe should have hard swapped out of my Vanellix. Keep him rolling, but he has that War Veil up, which is beautiful. He's gonna Dynamax his Torkoals. Gonna get that Dynamax. That's fine by me. That's fine by me, ladies and gentlemen. What do you want? What you want, fool? I'm coming for you. I am coming for you. Gonna go. Oh, Hatterene? Dynamax that Hatterene? Going after my... He's probably going after my... What's it called? My Cockadoor, which I'm fine with. Which, actually, I'm fine with. Go after my Cockadoor or something. Let's see what he does. Cockadoor's gonna go first. He has first move priority. With that Mach Punch, so we're gonna do a little bit of damage to that Torkoal. Go, Mach Punch. It's protected by the physical train? What do you mean, though? What do you mean, though? Eruption's a crazy move. This is a crazy move right here. Look at this. Just mercs on everybody on the team. And then it, what's it called? And then it will, uh, it doesn't do anything to him. Just such a strong move. That Max Mindstorm might be able to take us out here. Oh, eat that up, my boy Ben and Jerry. My boy! My boy, that Aurora Veil is huge. Hatterene is life form. Um, we're gonna go into our Milotic here. We're gonna rock out into the Milotic. That thing's probably gonna come after us. It's probably gonna come after us. We're gonna try to get this, uh, we go for the blizzard or the freeze dry. Hmm. Let's just go. I'm going off on that blizzard. I'm gonna go for that blizzard. And did we just go for a scald? Yeah, we're gonna go for a scald over on this uh, Torkoal. Did we go for a scald? I feel like he can do some work on us. What kind of defense are we? Let me check my Milotic's defense. I might just go into protect, try to waste turns out here. Let's go. Let's check summary here. If we're special defense, we would go for a scald. If not, oh, we are defense. We're gonna go for a protect here. Where do we go for recover? We're just gonna go for a protect here. Try to waste out these turns. We're just gonna try to waste out these turns. Eventually get this trick room out the way. And once this trick room gets out the way, then we will roll out into our frost last Dynamax him or my Milotic and go off. And go off here. Torkoal absorbs sunlight. That's fine by me. He's gonna go after my. Who you gonna go after? You going after? Mm hmm. You going after my Milotic. Protect that. Eat that up. Max my is gonna come out here. You going after my Milotic. We'll eat that up. No problem. Let's go. Let's go. We're chilling here. Okay. Now we're getting this blizzard off here. Let's go double it up here. Freeze somebody. Show me some freezes. Show it to me. Nope, no freezes. Left is gonna pop out here. We, what are we gonna go for? He's probably gonna go for another one of those. Uh, can blizzard freeze? Let's see. Yeah, it can. Okay. So we're gonna go for another blizzard here. And we're just gonna go straight into a recover. We're gonna go straight into a recover on my boy. We got solar beam. Solar beam's gonna pop out here. Dang, dude. That sunlight is tough. That is tough. Going for it again. Can we eat this up? We are defensive tank, but this is special attack, isn't it? Yeah, I'm kind of scared. I'm kind of scared here. Eat it up, Milo. Eat it up, Milo. Eat up. Okay, you love to see it. You love to see it. We should be able to eat up the next shot here. We should be able to eat up this Max Mindstorm here. Come on, show it to me. And we get this recover off. Uh, no. No, please. We need that. To We need that. What's it called? That trick room to end. We need that trick room to end. Like, can it get out of here? It should be over soon. Let's go. Blizzard can come out here. Do a little bit of work. But now is chilling. Can we get a freeze? Should we freeze? Okay. We're back to normal. We are back to normal. Who do we need to go here? We need that Torkoal to go. Going in here, we're gonna Dynamax our Frost last year. Um, do we set the Storm? Do we set the Hail? I think we set the Hail here. We got some slow pokies. We got some slow pokies. He's probably gonna go for an eruption here. That's what I think he's gonna go for. We're gonna go into. No, you're not getting Dynamax. Uh, ch -ch 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 -ch. we gonna take out here. Who are we gonna take out? We're gonna go for the. Mm. We're gonna go for the freeze right here. And we're gonna take out that Hatterene with Stab or Shadow Ball. Is Ice Super. We're gonna Dynamax here. We're gonna set this Hailstorm here. Get that Drought out the way. Stab should kill it. Stab, Ice, Hailstorm. Should take him out. It should take him out. Let's go. We should outspeed here. We're gonna go for this Hatterene. Get this thing out the way. Maybe I should have took out that Torquil. I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure, but I wanna get this Hatterene out the way. I feel like my what's called could eat up a shot. I feel like my boy Frost Lass can eat up a shot. If not, Vanellix will outspeed that Torkoal all day. We'll outspeed that Torkoal all day. But my Frost Lass will go first. Let's go, Frost Lass. Show him how it's done. Max Hailstorm coming out here. Come on. Take out the Hatterene. We need it with the stab. Do it, do it, do it. Let's go. Hatterene gone. Hatterene gone. Hailstorm is popping off here. We're going to go now. Get a little bit of boost with our ice move. Freeze dry on that Torkoal here. If we just put it down to a decent amount of health... Oh, it's going to go for an eruption here. Come on, show me that freeze or something. 
Let's go. Do something dirty. Do something gross. Come on. We've been going for freezes all day. Show it to me. Yes! Yes! Just what we wanted. Just what we wanted. Game over. Game over. Finally, we get a freeze off. Actually, came up clutch. He was probably going to go for that eruption, but I feel like my frost ice would have ate one up. I feel like he would have ate it up, and that is the game. Go for another freeze dry here, and then we're just going to rock out into a max phantasm. Get that stab once again on this Torkoal and say, night, night. This guy's probably going to cancel this battle, but we're chilling. That is how it's done. That is how you rock out with this freeze team, baby. Let's go, dude. Hail is my favorite weather type. It is my favorite weather type. It's just beautiful. I love everything about it. I love everything about the team. I love the Pokemon. I love their moveset. I just, I don't know. It's just something about it. It's just something so different that I love. That I just love about it. What's he thinking about? You thinking about either canceling the battle? Like, what, did you, what are you thinking about, dude? You're done. You were done. You get to buff it. We outspeed you. Both Pokemon outspeed you. We're going for a stab max Phantasm, right? Phantasm is a ghost one, yeah. That's night night. Dude, Frost Ice is so cool. I love the ghost and the ice combo. Like, so rare, so rare. Is he like one of the only Pokemon with that? Might be the only Pokemon with the ice ghost combo. And my Vanellix just survives this whole battle. Just murking out here. What you want, fool? What's he gonna go for? I don't even know what he did. He didn't even cancel the battle, but that should be game right here. Boop. See you later, Torkoal. See you later. Let's get it. Let's get it, guys. That is how it is done. That is how you rock out with this Hailstorm team. Let's go. Let's get it, guys. That is how it's done. This team is one of my favorite teams I've played in a long time. It's just something so off meta and so different, something I haven't seen before. I just love everything about it. It is awesome. But, guys, if you like to use this team for yourself, rental code is at the bottom of the screen. Definitely check it out. Definitely check it out. And also, guys, leave me rental codes in the comment section down below. I would love to use your guys' team. And hopefully, my voice will be better for the next video. <laughs> kind of funny, kind of funny. But, guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. If you're new here, click that big red subscribe button so you know when my videos go live thank you guys so much for watching i'll see you all in the next one peace out everyone